Hi guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I want to show how to make explainer text animation with Illustrator and After Effects. So I will use vector scenes from freebig.com. So let's select this all scenes, all layers, and let's select, hold, control, shift, select all this. Let's select first, select this scene, let's select like this, control C and go to file, new, and select this full HD size, click for create. Then control V for paste and hold, shift, change, scale. Okay, so let's create new layer with this icon and change name background. Let's move to behind layer one and let's try two color for background, white and yellow. Let's go to here, select this range tool and let's make background layer and click session tool then go to this airdropper let's click here for yellow background click selection tool and let's open here open inside let's close white layer okay not bad let's hide this pad and select background, click this circle, let's try change background color white, go to again eyedropper, let's click here, let's click session tool, okay, white, not bad, this is yellow and this is white background, so let's select this text, select this group, let's click delete, and select this shadow, delete, and select this group, delete, and this group, delete, and this group, delete. Okay, select this group and click this circle for select all layers, and hold shift, let's change scale. Okay, and let's try again change background color, let's select this background and click this icon, Control C and create new layer, Control F. Okay, select this and let's select this layer 3, let's open here, select this wrench, move to inside layer 3. And change background to let's change background yellow and this background white <clears throat> so select this background yellow yeah let's click this icon and let's enable this pad and let's select this color with eyedropper color icon Click selection tool. Okay, select this pad and click here and delete. So, for example, we have two ways for use background. Background yellow and background white. So, which? Okay, I will save these two layers for animation. And let's hold shift Hold Ctrl Shift, select this pin and this inside circle, Ctrl X and go to create new layer, Ctrl F. Let's change name, pin, let's hide. Then 
Let's select this sun. Again, hold Ctrl Shift, select this, Ctrl X, create new layer, Ctrl F. Okay, let's change name sun and hide layer. Select this cloth, Ctrl X, uh, create new layer, Ctrl F, add name cloth 1 and hide layer. Let's again hold Ctrl Shift, select this, Ctrl X for cut and create new layer, Ctrl F, add name, cloth 2. Okay. So let's save this uh, project. Let's Ctrl S, go to create new folder, add name, explainer taxi. Open explainer and create new folder again and add name vectors open vectors folder and add name scene one click or click save click OK okay then let's select this yellow background and let, let's lock layer click here for locking and let's select this layer, hold Ctrl Shift, select this and Ctrl X and create new layer, Ctrl F and change layer name, Shadow. Okay. And select this, Ctrl X, add name, let's add name plant. Okay, and so let's prepare these taxi layers. First step, select these wheels. Let's hold Control Shift, and let's select this part and this, and this. Let's zoom to wheel, and this part, this, and this. Let's control X. Okay, let's select here. Let's control Z again. Okay, let's control X and create new layer. Control F. This is well one. And let's select this again. Control X. Let's select this well. Control F. And open here, select this group, let's move to back here. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see original image. Let's zoom to here. Okay. So let's hide this wheel one and select this black control x create new layer control f let's uh, hide background yellow okay and let's select this wheel control x create new layer control f and add layer name wheel 2 then select these wheels, select this part and this and this, this and this. Control X, create new layer, Control F, and select this part, Control X, and open this wheel, Control F, and move to back. Okay, so let's Control S and change name wheel 3. And finally, well 4. Let's hold Ctrl Shift, select this, Ctrl X, and create new layer, Ctrl F, and change name well 4. Okay, and hide layer. 
So let's hold Ctrl Shift, select this, Ctrl X, create new layer, Ctrl F. Okay, in this time, select this wheel and move to up here. Enable this wheel. And this layer. And this wheel 2. Wheel 3. And select this wheel 3. Let's move to up here. And wheel 4. Okay, nice. So friends, after prepare wheels, I will prepare other objects on car. Okay, hello, hello, welcome Mahmoud, welcome live bro. Okay, hello, hello, welcome. So, okay. Then uh, let's change this layer name car black one and change this layer car black two. Okay, so Let's select this reflection and delete. Select this window and let's select this Control X. Control X and go to create new layer, Control F. This is glass one and let's hide layer. Then select this glass. Let's hold shift control, select this and this and this. Control E. Let's select this also. Control X. And go to create new layer. Control F. Let's see here. Okay. Let's hide layer. And select this layer. Control X. Create new layer. Control F. So let's change this layer name glass to and select this layer move to up here change name glass object <coughs> and select this layer let's hide these layers Okay, so let's change this layer name car and enable other layers. Select this pin and sun, cloud layers, shadow and plant. Move to behind these layers. Okay, that's good. So, let's see, this is yellow background and this is white background. Okay, so let's close this scene and go to original vector. Let's select this scene too. Let's hold Control shift select this part and control c go to file new and click for create control f and hold shift chain scale let's open here and don't forget to save layer control s change uh, layer name scene 2 click save and click OK. And in this time, let's select this group layer. Let's delete. And let's see. Select this shadow, delete. Select this layer. Let's see which layer this. 
Okay, this background layer, delay it. And select this path, delay it. And this, delay it. And this search icon, delay it. Also, select this text, delay it. And this group, delay it. So let's control A, select all layers, hold, shift, chain, scale. Let's move to here. Okay. So in this time, let's prepare this character layers. First step, let's select, hold, control, shift, select this hand layer. And select this part and this part. Okay, and let's control X. Go to create new layer, control F for paste. And change the layer name, hand. Let's hide layer. Let's then select this phone. Control X, create new layer, control F. Okay, let's hide layer, change name, mobile or change phone. Hey friends, welcome live again, welcome new viewers and please don't forget to like this live, it's very important for me and for growing channel. Thank you so much. So uh, let's select this layer, Control X, create new layer, Control F. Let's Control Z, select this circle also and this red pin, Control X. Create new layer, Control F, change layer name, pin, hide layer, and select this red, Control X, create new layer, Control F, and change layer name. Finish. Okay, let's hide layer. And let's select this part and make single layers. First step, select this, Control X. And let's create some layers. And let's Control F. And select this, Control F. Select this, Control F. And select this, Control F. Select this, Control X. And select this, Control F. Also this layer. So select this also, Control X and Control F. Okay, let's enable layer, add name, map 1. And this, map 2. And this layer, map 3. And this layer, map 4. And this layer, map 5, and map 6. And select this layer, add name, line. Let's change name, road line. Okay, select this road line, moved up here. And let's see, okay. And hide layers. Let's select this, Control X, and create three layer. One, two, three. Let's Control F, and select this, Control X, and Control F, and this yellow, Control X, and Control F. So, let's select this layer. Object white and move up this layer, add name object green and this let's move up object yellow. Let's hide layers and select this dollar icon, control X. And select this layer, 14, Control F. Add name, 
dolar. Ok. So, hide layer. Suvibum, hello, hello, welcome live. So, in this time, let's select this yellow circle, control X, create new layer, control F, and this control X, control F. Add name, circle yellow one. Let's change not one and circle green. Okay, and select these two circles. Let's delay it. Okay, and then let's select this layer. First step, select the stars, Control X, and create five stars. One, two, three, four, five, and Control F. Hide layer and this Control X. Select this Control F and this star and this star. And this. Okay, let's change layer names. Star one, star two, and star three, star four, and star five. So hide layers and select this layer green, control X, create new layer, control F and add name, uh, star background. Okay, not bad. And so, and now let's prepare this character vector layers. First step, let's select this body, select this neck and this white and body. Control X, create new layer, Control F, add name, body, hide layer. And let's select this check icon, Control X, create new layer, Control F, add name, check. And select this, Control X, create new layer, Control F, add name, check, background. Okay, let's select this here, hold, Control Shift, select here, Control X, and create new layer, Control F, and select this layer 1, delay it. So, in this time, let's select this hand layer and phone layer move to behind here behind to body enable body layer and let's select this layer move to up change name here okay let's uh, select this check and check background move to up here and enable all layers Okay, select this stars. Let's select uh, here. Check, check background here, body, hand, and phone. Move to up here. Okay, that's good. And select this stars and start background. Move to up here. Okay, not bad. Aleykum Salam Yakub. Hoş geldin. Çok sağ ol. İyi yayınlar. Sene de iyi izlemeler. So let's see original image. Okay, not bad.
So friends, uh, don't forget to like this live. Thank you so much and welcome new friends. Please don't forget to subscribe channel. It's very important for me and for Grand Channel. So let's prepare uh, scene three. And this is final scene. Let's close this scene too and let's hold control shift select this finally scene control C go to file new and click for create control F change scale and let's op let's control S for save change save name layer name scene 3 click save click ok and open here let's select this group and delete open here again select this group and this text let's delete and this circles delete and this pet delete this download delete okay nice so let's control a and hold shift change scale okay and let's open layer one and select this car I will delete this car and so I have this car prepare layers let's select this circle and select all layers for car and delete okay okay then let's uh, select this phone layer and this call center Okay, I want to delete these layers. Let's click for delete. And select these builds. Let's move to left. And con and let's move to right like this. And control X, create a new layer, control F and hold alt move to right for make duplicate let's move to right okay change scale like this okay let's change name builds one and hide layer let's select this control x create new layer control f and let's hold alt move to left for duplicate and move to left okay select these two layers let's move to left like this and select this move to left again hold alt move to right for duplicate or let's delete and select this let's change scale like this Okay, not bad. Let's change layer name builds to and hide layer. Again, select this pin layer, control X, go to create new layer, control F, add name pin and select this message layers. Okay, let's go. So let's prepare finally these okay, let's go. layers. And after I prepare these layers, I will go to After Effects for create animation. So let's select this layer. 
Ctrl X, creating layer, Ctrl F. And change name text one. Let's change text blue. And hide layer, select this, Ctrl X, create new layer, Ctrl F, change name blue. Okay, hide layer and let's hold Ctrl Shift, select this. Let's first step select these text layers. Ctrl X, create a new layer, Ctrl F. Again, this Ctrl X and Ctrl F. Change name, text yellow. And hide layer, select this Ctrl X, create new layer, Ctrl F, change name yellow. Okay, so select this layer one, let's delete and enable all layers. Select this text and text backgrounds and pin, move to up like this. Okay, not bad. So let's close this layer and go to After Effects for Create Animation. Okay, let's first step go to file and save us. Click save us and save our project. Let's go to our explainer taxi and create new folder and add a name after effects and go to open this folder and add file name taxi explainer 2022. Click save. Then right mouse, import and file. Let's go to again, explainer folder, open vectors and select this all scenes, scene 1, scene 2 and scene 3. Change import as composition return line size. Click import. Okay, let's control S for save and create new folder, add name for folder for move to these folders, move to trash and let's create new composition, add name main taxi click, let's change time duration 15 click ok and select this scene 1, let's move to inside here ok and this is scene 2 and scene 3. Okay, first step, let's let's open scene 2. And let's see here. What's the original image? Okay, first scene go taxi and I will make first scene still car 2 and go to drive then order and then order finish so let's open scene 1 and select this pin let's go to solo and Move the anchor point down. Click station tool. Press P. Make new passing chain frame. And go to change chain frame for shortcut. You can use hold shift. Press page down in the keyboard. And let's 
move the down go to 10k frame again select first j frame ctrl c and ctrl v select j frames make easy let's see okay select j frames and let's use expression for endless loop animation let's hold icon click uh, hold icon and click time icon and hold alt click time icon sorry and go to click play button property and loop out duration for down expression click this empty area let's see okay this very fast animation let's select these 3k frames and hold alt move to right let's see okay select so frames again hold alt move to right okay not bad let's unsolo nice let's again hold alt select all layers and all chain frames move to right okay nice so select this select this cloth and this cloth press p make new passing chain frame and go to last second five second and let's move to right this and this move to left let's see okay and select the sun press p make new passing chain frame and go to here move to down and go to here move to left and move to up Okay, let's control Z, delete chain frames and got last chain frame, let's move to up. Okay, that's good. So So uh, let's make simple animation uh, for this car uh, for drive. Let's close this shape frame settings and create new uh, null object. Go to layer new and null object. Let's move to here and select this palm behind icon move to here like this and click station 2 let's move to down let's here okay let's select this car and link to null object select null press air let's see okay nice so in this time let's select this car black one car black two link to car and select this car let's uh, select this null press air let's see okay uh, so select this let's select this grass move to right like this here and select let's create new null object again move to here let's this null object change name car and this wells and select this well one well two and well three well three well two and well four let's link to wells Let's control Z, select these wheels and let's move to down here. And now let's wheels link to null object. Select null, let's see. Okay, and let's select these wheels and car. Move to here, move to down like this. 
Okay, and... So, uh, select this layer, gr layer, layer glass and glass 2. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, glass. Click OK. And go to shape layers, hold this wrench tool and make one wrench like this. Click session tool and. Let's go to click fill, select this eyedropper, select this color. Let's move to light blue, click OK. And move to here. Let's open wrench 1, select this wrench uh, path 1, control D for duplicate and move. And let's move to right. Okay, let's delete path 1 and select again. Let's go to create new like this. Click session tool and move to anchor point here. Click uh, scale, uh, rotate, uh, selection tool, sorry, and let's change scale like this. Press air, chain rotation like this or this. Move to here and let's select this glass one and glass two. Let's right mouse, pre comps, add the name glass two, click OK and back to glass layer and select this glass composition. Control D for duplicate, select this shape layer change name reflection and move to inside this glass compositions then click toggle switch mode change none to alpha matte and let's see okay not bad and let's back to scene one select this glass object move to up here and select this glass object and glass Let's link to car. Okay, in this time, select this. Let's uh, select this wells, wells null object, link to car. Select this car, car null, null object. Let's see. Okay, and let's press R. No, let's control Z. Okay, and create a new layer new null object add name car main and move to here select this wheels link to car main select this car null object link to car main and in this time select this car main press p and make new passing k frame go to 10 k frame let's move to right for go to drive back Let's see. Okay, and select this. Go to here, make new passing keyframe. frame. Or let's go to here and move to left. Let's select keyframes, frames, make easies. Let's see. Okay, select keyframes, frames, go to graph editor and let's see. Let's select keyframes. frames. Go to graph editor again. Let's select this graph. Okay, web problem with shape frames. Select these three shape frames. Make select this shape uh, frame interpolation. Change auto bezier to linear. Click OK. Let's see. Okay, that's good. So in this time, select this car null object and press R. Hold Shift, press P make new shape frames and go to here let's change rotation like this change minus one and in this time make new rotation shape frame go to here and change rotation two 
or three. Let's see. Okay, let's change minus two. And select this last keyframe of the right. Okay, and let's change this rotation four. Okay, that's good. <clears throat> so, uh, select this shadow. Let's link to car main. Let's select shadow, go to effects, press it. And let's delete this shadow, go to shape layers, hold this icon, select this ellipse tool. And let's create a new shadow. Click selection tool and go to fill. Select this eyedropper. Let's select this background color and change to dark yellow. Click OK. Hello lifestyle. Hello, welcome and thank you so much. So select the shape layer, change name shadow, and move to behind car layer or wheels. and move to here let's see let's move to down chain scale okay so select the shadow link to car main okay that's good so in this time let's let's select this shape frame Move to right. Okay, that's good. Okay, not bad. So, let's open this glass and select this reflection. Let's press P, make new passing chain frame. Let's move to here. Move to left. And let's see chain frames for timing. Go to here. Let's back to glass and move to right. Let's see. Okay, this is very fast. Select shape frames, make easy ease, and go to graph editor, select this graph. Let's make graph like this. Let's see. Okay, let's move to left. Let's see here. Okay, and in this time, let's go to here and move to left. Let's see. Okay, so uh, let's go to here, delete these three frames, and select this reflection, move to back like this, and hold shift press air, change rotation like this. Hello BM Genion, hello welcome. And in this time, let's move to right and let's see, go to here, move to left, let's see. Okay, and in this time, go to here and move to right like this. Select three frames, go to graph editor and select this graph. Let's make like this. Then select these three three frames, make click three frame interpolation, change auto bezier to linear. Click OK. Let's see. 
Thank you, Mechanic Cars. Thank you so much. Okay, this again not good for me. Let's delete again chain frames. Make new person chain frame and move to here. Let's see. Okay, and in this time, let's move to right. And move to left like this. Select chain frames make easy and right mouse chain frame interpolation change auto bezier to linear i think this is better way for reflection okay that's good let's change press t change opacity like this let's see here okay that's good Thank you, thank you, Crazy Shock. Thank you so much. Welcome, life. Okay, not bad. So in this time, select this. Uh, select this plant. Press P and make new passing chain frame go to here and move to right let's see select chain frame make easy and select this pin press p make new passing chain frame okay this is expression let's create new layer new null object change name other objects move to here and move to anchor point to center hold control double click here clearization tool and move to center then let's delete plant keyframes frames and select this plant cloud layer sun and pin link to other objects select these other objects press p and let's see in this time make new passing chain frame go to here and move to right like this select chain frames and make easy okay So go to graphic editor and graphic editor select this graph and make smooth like this. Let's change graph like this. Okay, not bad. So let's click here for back to chain frames and let's open. Let's select this glass, glass 2, move to trash folder and open scene 2. Let's move to inside here. Okay, and move to right. And select this background white, control C, open scene 2 and control v let's move to behind here and let's select this con scene 2 control x close scene 1 go to main text taxi control v okay and in this time Let's select this scene 2. Let's open and select these stars. 
right mouse, precoms, add name, stars, click OK. And back to scene 2, select this uh, map 1, road line, map 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Right mouse and precoms, add name, map, click OK. Then let's right mouse go to create new null object and move to anchor point center. Let's hold control, double click anchor point, click station tool. Let's move to here and change name null object, objects, scene, objects. So uh, select this, let's select the stars, let's hide composition, select this map, hide composition, select this body. Okay, sorry, I'm here. So, uh, then, let's select this white background, press P, and make new passing keyframe, move to right, and go to first second, let's move to right. Or let's move to up. And select three frames, make easy. Go to graph editor, let's select this graph, make smooth graph like this. And this. Move to right this three frame. Okay, not bad. So, uh, select this character body, go to solo and Move the anchor point down. Click session tool. And let's let's unsolo. Select this here. Go to solo. And move the anchor point here. Click session tool. Unsolo. And let's link to body. And select this hand layer. Go to solo. And I will use Duik for rigging this hand. Select this hand, go to Puppet Pin Tool. Let's add one puppet here, and one here, and here. Click Session Tool. Let's change Puppet Engine Legacy. Click OK. And then, when we select Puppet, go to Window, open Duik Bezel Tool. Click ignore. This is update message. And click here for rigging. And click this icon. Or this, okay. And when we selected puppet, click add bones. Okay. So select this puppet pin 3, link to 2, select 2, link to 1. And select this 1, let's link to body. Where is body? Okay, here. And select these three puppets. And go to click auto rig IK. And let's close the window. Let's see. Okay, but we have problem with puppet like this. This problem. Let's select this hand layer. And go to click puppet. Click this 
checkbox for on transparent. Let's click. Okay, let's see. Select controller. Okay, very nice. So let's unsolo all layers. Let's see. And select this phone. Let's link to controller. Let's see. Select controller. Okay, very nice. So, in this side, we can make a we can make create animation for this body let's select controller and press air make rotation chain frame and chain rotation like this go to 10 chain frame change like this go to 10 again chain rotation select chain frames make easy let's see okay let's Go to here, select last chain frame, delete, select these two chain frames, move right. Okay, and let's hold shift, press P, and go to here, make new rotation again, go to five chain frames, chain rotation like this. Again, go to five chain frames, make new rotation, and go to here, chain rotation like this. Okay, and now let's go to here and make new passing chain frame. Go to center. Let's move to down this body for bones effect. And go to last chain frame. Select first chain frame. Control C, Control V. Select chain frames. Make easy. Let's see. Okay, nice. Select these three chain frames. Control C. Go to here. Control V. And hold Alt. Move to right. Okay, that's good. Let's see. And go to here again, Control V. And select these chain frames, move to right. Let's see. Okay, that's good. So in this time, select this here, press Air, make rotation chain frame, and go to here. Chain rotation like this. Select chain frames, make easy. And move to right. And in this time, make new rotation, go to here, chain rotation like this. Select chain frames, move right. Let's select these two chain frames, move to left. Okay. And in this time, make new rotation again, go to here, and chain rotation for look for okay not bad so let's add again bones effect for here select this here and hold shift press p make new passing chain frame and go to here let's move to down go to here again say first chain frame control c control v and let's change make chain frames easy let's see okay select select the three chain frames control c go to here control v again control v let's see nice so let's make some chain frames for this hand select this controller and let's Let's go to icon, change size like this. Okay, say controller, let's move to right. And press P, make new passing chain frame, go to here and move to up like this. Say chain frames, make easy. Let's see. Select chain frame, move to right. And here, make new passing chain frame. Got five chain frames. Let's move to down. And here, got here and make new passing chain frame again. Got five chain frame and 
moved like this let's go to here and let's add new shape frame here let's move to down okay and here let's add new shape frame nice so let's select this hand layer and this puppet pins body here then hand form let's see okay and right mouse precoms add name character click ok let's see ok nice so go to here scene 2 and let's hide character layer select this white background and ctrl d for duplicate let's move to right Again, Ctrl D, move to right. Select this first background white. Go to Effect Presets, search Effect Fill. Select Fill, let's move to inside background white. And change color like this. Click OK. And select this background white too. Let's use Fill. Let's select this eyedropper and change color like this click ok let's see okay that's good so in this time select this character let's enable and let's press s change scale and change again scale move to down okay let's press p make new passing keyframe move to right and move to down select keyframe make easy let's see let's move to right select keyframe go to graph editor let's make smooth graph Let's move to right again this shape frame. Okay, open character and press U for see all shape frames and select these shape frames and move to right. Let's see. Okay, nice. Let's back to main taxi. Let's see. Move to left. Okay, not bad. Okay, so then let's go to again scene two and let's make other other object shape frames for animation. Let's Let's hide character and select this object green, object white and yellow and dollar. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, money, click OK. Then let's select this layer, move to here and select this object white, white control, control D and let's use fill click this eyedropper select this color and select this object green delete change this object white to green okay this is object green and this is white so select this object green let's go to here hold this icon select this wrench tool and let's make wrench like this Open mask one, click station tool, and select this mask 
layer mask like this and go to here make new mask pad and let's move to left like this let's again select mask one and hold this point hold shift move to left okay so go to here and again select mask one select this point hold this point with left mouse and hold shift move to right okay select three frames make easy let's see okay select three frames go to graph editor make smooth graph back to chain frame select last chain frame move to right nice so select this yellow object yellow press p and move to left here make new passing chain frame and go to here move to right select chain frame make easy go to graph editor select this graph let's make like this okay let's change graph like this okay let's select this mask layer let's press u and let's see graph okay So select this chain frame, let's move to right. Select this chain frame, move to left. Okay, here problem, let's select chain frames, go to graph editor and let's make graph like this. Okay, let's control Z. Select this graph, move to left, and this graph, move to right. Okay, that's good. So, let's select this layer, layer dollar, and press S. Let's go to here and Let's go to last chain frame, make scale chain frame, go to first second, chain zero. Select chain frame, make easy and let's link to object yellow, let's see. Okay, that's good. So select this dollar, let's control D and move to right, press P, move to left. Let's see. Okay, press S and go to here, change scale 90 or 70. Okay, let's select this dollar, cook, uh, dollar 2, control D, move to right, press P and let's move to left. Let's move to here, select this, move to here press P move to left and select this dollar 3 press S go to last chain frame change 40 okay let's see not bad so let's go to click this icon region of interest and select this region go to composition click uh, click crop come to region of interest okay not bad so let's close composition and character composition let's see here and let's enable character move to here this let's see original image okay 
press S, change scale, move to right, and press P. Let's make new passing keyframe, move to right, and move to right this composition. Select these keyframes, go to keyframe and stand, go to easy ease, go to graph editor, make smooth graph. Let's select last keyframe, move to right. Back to keyframe again. Okay, nice. So friends, wait please one minute, I will back. Okay, sorry, I am here again. <clears throat> so friends, uh, let's back to scene 2 and let's see. Okay, let's open money and select all layers, close settings, press U for CK frames. And select all K frames. Move to right. Let's see. Okay. Let's see here. Let's go to money and move to left. Okay, close money composition. Let's see. <laughs> nice. So, uh, let's go to here. Let's open map let's enable open map composition and let's go to scene 2 let's select this check and check uh, pin and finish control x go to map and control f control v for paste and let's select this pin select this palm behind move the anchor point down and click session tool Let's go to first second, press R and make rotation keyframe, change rotation minus 25 or 60, minus 60. Go to 10 keyframe, change plus uh, 30. Go to 10 keyframe, change minus 15. Again, go to 10 keyframe, change plus 7. Go to 10 keyframe again, change minus 3. Again, go to 10 keyframe, change 1. Go to again 10 keyframe, change 0. So, this, uh, this more keyframes for smooth bones effect. Select these keyframes, make easy. Let's see. Okay, select this pin, hold, sh hold shift, press S, make scale keyframe, move to right. And change scale zero. Let's see. Okay, that's good. Select your frames, make easy. So in this time, let's go to let's select this road line, go to solo, and let's draw again new rod with pen tool. Okay, so let's uh, select this pen tool. Let's draw like this. And click session tool, go to click fill. Select is known, click OK. Change stroke width. And let's unsolo. And select is road line, delete. Select is shape layer, change name, rod, line. And go to color, let's change. Like this, let's select this red. Let's see. Okay. Let's select this road line. Go to stroke. Let's select with eyedropper. Okay, then select this road line and go to add. Select trim pads. Open trim pads here. Go to first second, change end zero, make end keyframe and go to here, let's change 100, 
Select keyframe. Make easies. Let's see. Select keyframe. Move to right. Okay, select keyframes. Go to graph editor. Let's make smooth graph. And this smooth. Let's move to right keyframe again. Okay, not bad. So, uh, select this finish and press S. Also, we can use animation composite with one click. Go to window, open animation composite 3, open start preset to the layer. Let's select this overshot scale, click in. Let's see, move to right, tear in for slow animation and move to right. Okay, and in this time, let's move to right here. Nice. So, let's uh, select these map layers. Select all these layers. And... Press P. Go to here. Make new passing keyframe frame and go to first second. Let's select this. Move to left and this. Move to here and this and this this and this select keyframes frames and make easy go to graph editor select this graph make smooth let's see okay and let's select all layers click overshot scale click in let's see So close animation comes here and select these shape frames, move to right and select this tier in, move to right for slow animation. Let's say again. Okay, so let's close shape frames and let's make random animation. Let's move to right for random scale okay that's good not bad select this move to left and this move to left and select this road lion pin and finish let's move to right here and back to scene 2, let's see. Okay, select this map, let's move to right. Nice, let's move to left. Okay. So press N, let's select work area. And select this check background let's select this palm behind icon move to here click station tool and select this check link to check background and select check background go to window again open animation composite 3 and open starter preset and let's select this overshot scale click in move to right let's see Okay, not bad. So, uh, let's select these checks and go to solo. Let's select this pen tool. Let's add mask like this, click station tool and go to fill, uh, effect preset, search effect stroke. I will use stroke effect animation from generate folder. Let's select stroke. Let's use for this check. 
and change paint style original reval original image change brush size and brush hardness let's change 100 then let's change end zero make end k frame press select this check press u for ck frames go to here and change end 100 let's move right Select K frame make easy and go to graph editor select this graph let's make smooth then back to K frames and select this K frame move to left let's unsolo let's see move to left okay not bad then select this check and check background let's move to right here Okay, let's move to here. Move to right again. So let's select these yellow layers, delete, and let's do full animation here. Close like this. Okay, nice. So uh, let's go to scene two again. Open stars. Let's enable. Move to up. And let's original image. Okay, move to here. Open stars and select this star background. Press S. Click this icon. Go to first second. Make scale K frame. Move to right and change scale. Zero. Select key frames. Make easy. Is go to graph editor and make smooth graph. And let's select this graph. Make smooth like this. Back to key frames and select last key frame. Move to right. Okay. So. Let's go to window, open animation composite 3, open starter preset and select this overshot scale. Let's select this star 1, star 2, 3, 4, 5 and select this overshot scale, click in. Then select this star. Let's move to right and this and this and this. Let's see. Okay, select the stars. Let's move to right. Okay, not bad. So close this animation. Animation composite window and back to uh, scene 2. And move to right. Let's see. Okay, let's move to right. Okay, nice. So, uh, let's open scene 3. Let's move to inside here. And move to right. Let's uh, go to scene 2, let's right mouse, composition settings, change 6 seconds, click OK, and change size like this. Also this. So let's close scene 2 and open. Let's uh, select this scene 2, let's select this. Background layers, Control C, close and open scene 3, Control V. Let's see. Okay, so in this time, press P and delete key frames, close all these key frames, and select this white, background white, press P, go to here, make new passing key frame, and go to first second. Let's move to right. 
and select your frames make easy is go to graph editor select this graph make like this move to right let's, let's select this background layers other layers and height okay let's move to right so select these keyframes, frames control c and let's enable other layers select this background y2 go to here and control v let's see and select this control v okay not bad so select these background layers move to back and let's see and let's go to here let's open what is okay precoms let's select this scene one control d for duplicate let's move to inside here and open scene four let's delete background layers and delete let's delete clothes sun pin let's delete and plant okay so let's uh, go to scene 4 select the shadow go to fill let's change shadow like this click ok and let's press u for ck frames let's delay close all key frames okay nice so select this scene 4 let's move to here press s change scale and move to down let's move to right go to first second here press p make new passing keyframe frame and go to last second move to left select keyframes. frames let's see okay let's go to three second move to left this keyframe. frame okay so uh, select this build 2 and build 1 let's uh, select this build 2 this is background builds and right mouse precoms add name b2 click ok and let's select this control d and say let's link to here and select this build 1 press p make new passing keyframe and move to left select this build press p move to right let's see and select this build layer let's move to right like this okay and go to five second let's move to left let's see okay not bad select this build layer control d press p move to right let's see here let's see scene 3 okay so in this time let's select the build 2 press t make opacity keyframe and go to here change 0 let's see okay not bad and let's select this build 1 right mouse precoms add name b1 click ok and select this build layers go to first second let's control d and let's link to here select this build layer press p make new passing keyframe and go to five second let's move to left select the build control uh, let's press p move to right like this and select this last keyframe move to left again let's see here let's see here 
Okay, back to build 2. Let's select this delete. And select last shape frame. Move to right for slow animation. And select this build 1. Go to here. Let's move to left. And select this build, Control D, press P, move to right for endless builds. Let's see. Okay. Let's press T, make opacity shape frame, go to here and change zero. So uh, let's select this build, right mouse, go to time and time reverse. Okay, that's good. And select these opaque shape frames, move to here. Let's delete. Let's control Z, select these shape frames, right mouse, shape frame assistant, and time reverse shape frame. Okay, let's move to right these shape frames. Nice, and select this build 2. And right mouse, go to time. Time reverse and select shape frames, move to here. Right mouse, this shape frame, go to shape frame stand and time reverse shape frames. Let's see. Okay, that's good. So, in this time, let's select this open scene 4 and select this car layer. Uh, press P, make new passing chief frame. Go to 10 chief frame. Move to down, go to 10 chief frame again. Select first chief frame. Control C, Control V. Select chief frames. Make easy. And hold Alt, click this time icon for go to expression. And go to play, play button, property, and loop alteration. Let's see. Okay, let's select chief frames. Hold Alt, move to left for fast animation. Okay, let's see here. Nice. And select chain frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, uh, let's move to select last chain frame, move to here. And in this time, make new passing chain frame, go to here and move to left. Let's see. Okay, that's good. Select chain frames, go to graph editor. And let's see. Select chain frame and move to left. Okay, that's good. And let's see this part. Select chain frame. Let's move to left. Okay, that's good. Back to chain frames with this icon. And in this time, let's go to here. Select this scene four, and. Okay, select these other objects. Let's see. Okay, let's delete. And in this time, let's click Session Tool and go to here, Enable Ellipse Tool. Hold Shift, make one ellipse. Click Session Tool and change Click Fill, click None. And go to stroke, select white color. And open ellipse one here. Stroke and click dashes, click this plus icon. Let's change butt cup to round cup. Let's move to here. Okay, and go to here. Let's make offset chain frame. Go to last chain frame. Change like this. 
Pode ser? Let's change. 300. 800. Okay, not bad. So, select this shape layer. Let's control D and move to here. Let's see scene three. Nice. And in this time, let's go to here and let's close B1 layers. Go to scene and select this car. Press S. Press Air, make rotation keyframe. Let's press U for, for see other keyframes. Okay, and let's see timing. Okay, make select keyframe, move to here, and go to here, change rotation minus three or minus two, and go to here, plus one, go to here, zero. Select keyframe, make easy. Ease. Let's see. Let's see here. Okay, let's select K frames. Move to left. Okay, and in this time, back to here, make new rotation. Go to here and change like this. Change four. And minus three and zero let's see here okay that's good so back to scene four and select this glass let's right mouse go to uh, where is Reveal and Reveal Layer Source in Project. Let's click here. Select this glass. Let's Control D for make edits and select this glass. Move this, move to inside here. Select old glass, delete and move to here and select this glass object. Okay, let's. Move to down. Okay, so open glass two and select this reflection. Press P, delete shape frames. Move to left and make new shape frame. Go to here. Move to right like this. Select shape frames. Make easy. Ease. Let's see. Let's move to right. Okay, and go to here. Press N. Let's control Z, not N. Select these shape frames and go to edit, split layer and delete. Select these layers, right mouse, precoms, add name, reflection, scene 3. Click OK. Back to glass 2 and let's control D, move to right. We can also use loop expression for composition, but I will use this way. Okay, let's see. Go to scene 3. Okay, let's back to scene 4. And go to here. Let's move to up. And let's select this glass 2, link to car. Back to scene 3 again. Okay, that's good. So let's select this pin, delete, and text blue, delete, blue, and this text layers. Okay, we can add text or company logo here. So let's close all conversations and let's see. Let's move to left.
Okay, not bad. Press N and let's open scene 2. Open character. And let's select keyframes. First, this keyframes, Control C, go to here, Control V. And select this keyframes, Control C, Control V, and this Control C, Control V. Let's see. Okay, let's see. Let's select these three frames. Move to here. And move to here. Okay, not bad. So let's fix this problem. Let's select K frames, move to here. Select this J frame, move to up. Okay, let's delete these J frames, go to here, move to right, again go to here, move to left. Let's control Z. Okay, move to right. And make new passing chief frame, go to here. Move to up. Make new chief frame, go to here. Move to like this. Again, make new chief frame, go to here. Move to right. Okay. Okay, not bad. So friends, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram, this is my second channel. And if you want to support me, click only subscription button and add some comments for support me. It's very easy, I know, and thank you so much again. If you want to again this uh like this videos write comments i will make of course so thank you so much good luck